Hello everyone, how you all doing? I've been always fascinated by lava lamps. There's something about lava lamps that I really, really like. And so I decided to actually buy a big lava lamp. This one is 14.5 inches, for example. So this is definitely not big enough. So I decided to actually buy a double of this size, like this one. Check this out. Just compare boxes. Look at this one. This is a big box. This is a small box. And this one was in a small box. I can only imagine how big this thing is. So I'm gonna unbox it and see what's inside of it. Let's open this up. All right. Oh, well, looks like it's upside down. Oh, not really. Okay, look at that. This is the base. I can only imagine how big of a lamp is gonna be over here. Okay, here's the lamp. Oh, seriously? I thought it's gonna be a huge lamp. Yeah, look at that. This is the size of the lamp. Really? That should be probably extra strong lamp. What does it say? 120, 100 watt. Okay. I'm pretty excited to see this lamp assembled. There is the thing right here. Oh, man, it's heavy. Look at this one. This bottle is enormous. Check this out. This is the base. That's crazy. And here is the lamp. So I'm gonna put the lamp in. Yeah, right here. And now let's set this bottle on top, right here. It fits pretty well, actually. Pretty secured. Awesome. Okay, I can't wait to plug it in, actually, and see what will it look like. We'll plug it in. There you go. Oh, I forgot the lid. There you go. Look at this comparison and they're actually both the same color i love it so i don't know how long will it take to actually melt all this paraffin here i can't wait to see how this satisfying bubbling is going to be going up and down that's going to be amazing check this out this is actually a light bulb right here it says 120 volts and 100 watts bulb required that's crazy and in comparison, this is a small lava lamp light bulb. And here it says it requires 120 volts and 25 watts bulb. So this big lamp is actually requires four times bigger light bulb and four times stronger. Look what it says on this warning label here. Stop, your lava lamp will take four to six hours to reach optimal flow and color. That's insane. This is what happening after an hour and 30 minutes. Look at that. This paraffin is actually trying to turn over now. This is what happening after two hours. Finally, that paraffin is breaking up and going up. This little one is already melted like a long time ago. And this one is just started to waking up. That's crazy. Look at this. Pretty cool. So after two hours, this paraffin finally started to melt. And you know, comparing how hot this glass is on this small lava lamp and this big one is actually a big difference. This one is obviously way hotter than this one, like probably twice as much. Well, it's been almost three and a half hours and I can see a lot of things are changing right now. And the glass is actually way hotter than it was before. So it's been exactly four hours, like it said in the instructions. And right now it's one o'clock in the morning so I really wanted to wait all this long so I can see what exactly happening when this lamp is really really hot and this is what happens it's super super satisfying I'm actually very happy with this lamp right now and as you can see comparing to this more lava lamp this big one has actually bigger pieces of paraffin floating and that's really really cool well that's pretty much it I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one mm -hmm.